I love the look of vintage candles, so I thought I could make a giant version for my holiday decorations this year. These are made from PVC pipes and duct tape. These giant Christmas candles are super easy to make and look so festive on a front porch. I'm excited to show you how to make these. First, gather your supplies. I'm using three inch wide PVC pipe, white duct tape, and jumbo Christmas lights. I'm making six lights and the supplies cost me $143. Start by using a tape measure and marker to mark the PVC pipe to cut. We decide on three lengths for our candle bases, 14 inches, 20 inches, and 24 inches. To get a good cut on these, you need a good line. To get that, we measured from one end and marked the pipe every few inches, then we joined the lines to make one continuous line. Next, we used a jigsaw to cut the line on the PVC pipe. We rotated the pipe as we cut through. Note, jigsaw blades are usually for metal or wood. We used a metal blade and that worked great to get through the plastic pipe. Another saw would also work for this, like a miter saw or a circular saw. At this time, I also cut the wires off my jumbo Christmas lights. I didn't like how mine had to have wires between each light, so mine don't actually turn on. They're just decorative. I do link in my blog to other options that turn on with a battery. And now create wax drippings with a hot glue gun. This is an optional step, but I think using a hot glue gun to make it look like wax has dripped off the candle looks cute and realistic. To create the look of wax, I put drips in different lengths and connected them with a ring of hot glue at the top. This takes a lot of hot glue, so be prepared with extra glue sticks. For the hot glue gun, I'm using one from Ryobi. It has a battery in the base. I love that there's no cord. Heats up to mid or high heat and has different tips. It's the fanciest and nicest hot glue gun I've ever used. Now it's time to paint. I opted for spray paint for most of my candle bases. I applied two thin coats. For most places, spray painting outside isn't an option in the winter. Instead, you can add chalk, craft, or latex paint to the PVC pipe to paint. If you paint by hand, I suggest priming first and then adding the paint so it doesn't scratch off like I did with this coral paint. Finally, add a swirl of duct tape to each of the candle bases. I started at the top by the wax strip and worked my way down making sure to smooth the tape as I went. At the bottom, I cut the tape off on an angle. On the top where the tape doesn't look great because it's by the wax strips, I just had that be the back of the candle. I didn't cut all the light wires so I could show you how they look. It's a little messy so I prefer cut wires even though the lights don't work. And now here is how the vintage inspired DIY giant Christmas candles turned out. I think they're really cute and festive. I arranged them in rainbow order on my porch. They could be painted in any color and look adorable.